Hello, Leo, and welcome to your December of 2018 reading. The next reading I'll do is for the new year. I'll be reading for all 12 months. I'll have time to figure it out, so no worries. That's what we're going to be working on next time. I will have a Thunderdome out, though, so try your best to get some nice likes, and I'll do one for you. Right? Right. <clears throat> I don't like t talking too much about random shit. It's very distracting. Anyway... Let's go on to your reading, because that's who's really important right now. You. Yeah, so let's get, let's get these cards shuffled for a bit. Or not, okay. Wow. These all just came up on me. y'all been up to because you're definitely lacking some manipulations when it comes to a breakup of something or a toxic relationship like something didn't get manifested the way you wanted it to what the fuck dude like what am i looking at right here someone hiding an affair better not be my leo because i'll have a fit probably not i'll probably just get over it but you know it's whatever <laughs> like i really don't give a shit um, yeah, it almost looks like somebody's having an affair. Okay, like, that, like that's the complete vibe, and it, but it's like it didn't work out the way somebody expected it to, like, just shit luck with it. Like, here's the high priestess I hear hiding her true emotions, right? And it's not working. <laughs> it's totally not working. Either it's with a workplace situation, with the job itself, or somebody that they're dealing with, but something isn't getting worked out here. Someone doesn't have the skills for it. And down here, third part, third wheel situation. Could possibly be an affair, overindulgence. That didn't work out either. So there's two fucking pentacle cards saying, none of this is going to work. This affair isn't going to work out. And hiding all of this shit isn't going to work out. Like, you, you get why I'm saying affair? <laughs> and then someone took some risks. With the seven of swords. And they're coming for the fucking truth with the king of swords libra gemini aquarius he is not fucking playing <laughs> like that's what I, okay you see what i mean when i say it sounds like an affair though like are, did you catch somebody or did they catch you because this is like this is gonna be really fucking dramatic possibly whether you want it to be or the people involved want it to be but like this is like this is like when some dude got get hit by a car and, like, he was dead for a while, but then, like, he came back at, because it was a dream. I remember that soap opera from when I was a kid, and I don't know what the hell was going on. I think the dude's name was Dallas or some shit. But it was just weird. It was just, like, the dude just got hit by a car. At, not at a very fast speed. Like, miss me with that shit. <laughs> but, yeah, like, someone's definitely coming for the truth because what's going against them right now, or just the situation in general, because I don't know if it's actually against them. But, um, like, is someone coming for the truth with the King of Swords, or are they delivering this sword of the King as a risk? Ooh. Yeah. Um, someone doesn't want to even think about changing their ways, and someone needs to make a decision when it comes to this happy home, like this family life, right? Like, look at this. This is like family, kids, happiness, abundance, everything. Someone needs to make a decision about that. Someone's afraid of making a decision or coming to some decision. And down here, the Ace of Wands, where there is no new beginning, no new start. Like, something happened. Like, something didn't take off the way someone thought it would. Oop. Yeah. Like, because of enabling behavior. Some enabling behavior... Um, somehow this didn't work out, but I don't think it was a bad thing, like. Like, the beginning was lost or something, and now someone can't take off because they can't manipulate a takeoff? <laughs> what? It, like, oh my god, this is so dramatic. Okay, Leo. And whoever is dealing with Leo, right? Someone here 
was having an affair, a third party situation that did not work out. And now they're hiding their feelings. That's not working out. Um, someone is either coming for the truth or coming to deliver the truth. But what's going against them is they don't want to think about changing either. Like someone could tell you what exactly what's going on if they came up and asked you about it. I feel like you would be totally honest, even though it's a risk. Whoever this is. But it's the not changing their ways and not wanting to think about it. That's the problem. And now they got to come to some sort of decision <laughs> about um, this happiness, this completion, this happy home. Like, look at this. This is family. This is abundance. This is joy. Emotional. Pure joy. They make a decision about that because, like, like, do they feel like this beginning's just not going to happen because of all this bad shit? Where they can't begin something new because, like, it'd be, it would start out bad? Like, because they're not taking off and they aren't manipulating anything to happen. Right? Like, they're really contemplating on it, too. Like, thinking on it. Thinking a lot about it. Thinking about how much nothing is working in their favor. <laughs> like, having regrets about the fact that it doesn't work. Nothing's worked for them, man. Like, that's nice. I'm making, like, noodles so, like, I can eat shells and cheese. I'm totally munch on shells and cheese on everybody else's. I don't care. Oh, my God. Someone isn't coming to any sort of decision. <laughs> like, this is somebody who, um... This is someone who did not plan out what they were going to do, but, like, I don't know if that's you, Leo. Like, there's a couple... Uh, there, There's a couple of, like... There's a, there's a couple? There, there's not a lot of fire in this. I, like, I feel like you're the one that's sticking around because nothing's working or you just can't fucking leave. Because you can't manifest it to work. But I feel like this isn't even you who's doing any of this. Like, at all. I don't think it's you at all. Like, it's like some other scenario that you're either observing. Or something that's already happened. Or something that's been going through your head. But I don't think that it's you that's entirely doing this. If it is and I'm wrong, let me know. But it's like... I don't know if I am. Because it doesn't feel like you. Mm. Yeah, something isn't exactly happy in the home, you know. Hmm. Like, I feel like there's a little bit more regrets and someone not knowing what to do about those regrets. And it's just disrupted things. It, it's caused way more damage to the home than one realizes. Because I think something that got... Something that got sowed did not produce anything healthy. Right? Right. But that's yours, Leo. And I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.